Well, a San Fernando Valley Hospital suspended at least two nurses without pay for posting about working on a COVID-19 floor and the need for more protective equipment. KCAL 9's Christine Lazar spoke with those nurses and has a response from the hospital. Jonna Porter is a registered nurse with more than a decade of experience, and she wants to be working on the front lines of the COVID-19 pandemic. Instead, she is sidelined at home. And it just felt like, in a way, I was kind of retaliated against for speaking up and asking for help. Porter was placed on unpaid leave two weeks ago after she made a post in a private Facebook group for the nurses on her floor at West Hills Hospital. Hey, you guys, the rumors are true. You know, our floor is becoming the COVID floor, um, so be careful. Porter also listed the rooms these patients were being taken into. Because at the time, like I said, we didn't know if it was airborne. We didn't know, you know, what the dangers are. Porter was disciplined because the hospital says she potentially violated HIPAA, which protects patient privacy. Porter feels like she was retaliated against. I do feel a lot of it has to do with the fact that 20 hours prior, I had posted on my own personal Facebook page the fear of the lack of protection that we were being given for PPE. Porter's fellow RN at West Hills, who asked us not to identify him, is also on unpaid leave after he too made a post asking for donations of protective gear. I didn't think it would be controversial because it's all about safety. Both nurses now have all this protective gear just sitting in their homes. They say West Hills Hospital won't let them deliver it to their coworkers. It seemed to me that, uh, because I was the most outspoken about the um, lack of PPE at the hospital, it seemed that they were essentially um, trying to silence me and intimidate other nurses from being outspoken. We reached out to West Hills Hospital and in a statement, the hospital said its staff can express themselves on social media as long as their posts don't violate patient privacy. Late today, I got a phone call from both nurses telling me that the hospital did reach out to them today, saying they can return to work tomorrow.